How's it going Rebels? I'm Bunning with ASG. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're not so much doing any kind of advice or tips or anything. We're talking about something that's a little bit different as far as the game related. As many of you might have already heard or know, we lost CM Lexi just a couple days ago. We're not sure if he quit or if he was fired or what exactly happened because Cagside for the most part is trying to sweep this under the rug. They don't want us talking about it, they don't want us discussing it, they don't even want it brought up. Plenty of people have been forum banned, they've been deleting threads, locking threads all over the forums, essentially stopping us from communicating, but I say fuck that. At least for me, being American and our freedom of speech, one of our founding amendments, when someone tells me that I can't talk about something or when someone tries to lock down threads and entire sections on the forum where players are looking for answers, they just want some kind of response, that annoys me. We just want a statement from Cacti explaining what happened, why did Lexi leave, or why was he fired. The reason why is probably more detrimental to Cacti than they're even more willing to admit. Was it some kind of update? Was there just a disagreement between him and management? Was there something that happened between him and a player? Did, was he unprofessional? If he was unprofessional, which in my opinion is highly unlikely, it's a couple of the rumors that I've heard spreading around, is that something happened between him and a player. I don't think that is in any way possible. Lexi was a smartass. Yes, he was. We all know he was. But that's just it. He was a smart ass. He never did anything that crossed that line. He was respectful to a point when he dealt with someone that was being a dumbass, he handled them in a more sarcastic and sometimes seemed annoying, but it was still a very professional manner, whether he was on the forums, whether he was on Facebook. Every time I saw a post with Lexi in it, he was funny, he was a nice guy, he was always humorous. But he always kept it professional no matter what it was, which leads me to believe that there was something going on between him, Kexai, management, some kind of update, something going in with a, a patch update, something dealing with the aliens, perhaps there are so many options that could have come down between Lexi either being fired or leaving the company. We simply want an answer from Kexai, and more importantly than that, we want to know who Lexi's replacement is going to be. Is it going to be CM Scarlet? There's plenty of others that could replace him, not saying that they'll be anywhere near as good as Lexi has been, but there's an old statement we have, everyone is replaceable, and we want to know what we've got in store. Can we expect someone who's not even going to be there? Lexi was always there. You needed him? Tag him. He would be there the second he got on. He always replied back. He, like I said, he might have been a smart-ass answer if you gave a dumb-ass question, but he always replied, something that the other CMs can't exactly claim that to do. A lot of times they would either just completely dismiss if they felt it was a stupid question and completely ignore the community, unlike Lexi, or they would simply just close it down, sweep it under the rug like Kekshai is doing right now. They're having their moderators and their forum mods and their other CMs just completely sweep this under the rug, and it's annoying. I just want an answer, Kekshai. I'm gonna be straight up. Now, with all that out of the way, I want to tell a little bit of a story real quick. Now, CM Lexi, or just Lexi now, I suppose, it's almost become so common to call him CM Lexi, it kind of had a ring to it, you know? To be honest, I haven't known Lexi very long. It's only been about, I would say, maybe about a year or so, give or take. When I joined BV Battle Vortex, it was the very first opportunity for me to meet him. They had a much deeper connection because they had been dealing with Kekshai doing the Battle Vortex for several years, from my knowledge. And so Lexi, being the community manager, had created that connection between those and so when I joined that was the first time I met him first time I really talked to him he seemed like I said a smart ass but when you really get to know Lexi he was a good guy he was respectful he was nice if you came to him open and honest he would show you that same respect right back at you I believe the first time I talked to him was right about the time that we were doing the Paul Priest interview a lot of you remember how Pretty crazy that was, we had a little bit of a hiccups and stumbles, but for the most part, everyone tried to be respectful, they tried to give Paul his undoing respect, we could tell that it was so nerve-wracking for Lexi. You could just see how <sighs> Paul just did not like that at all, that he had to do this. It seemed so beneath him, and Lexi was trying to put on this, this front of keeping everyone happy. He wanted the community to be happy, but at the same time, Paul was his boss, so he had to also try to keep him happy as well. I believe that's one of the main reasons we've never done it again, is Paul was unhappy that we were bringing these questions. He thought the community was these dumbass little shits. He, he did not like the community at all, and he found out what Lexi had to deal with. 
the community rip Paul an entire new one that were memes or forum posts. There was all kinds of. Remember, uh, what was it? Uh, all hell the clown. I forgot what it was. It was uh, there's like Paul Priest's face, but with a red nose. And Lexi handled that so perfectly. Like dealing with the forums, the Facebooks of all of that matter. He had to deal with all of that, and in my opinion, he handled it better than most. If Paul had been the one dealing with that, I feel like he would have just blown up and ended up just completely ranting about how unfair the community's treating him and blah, 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 blah. Lexi never did any of that. Like I said, he always kept it professional, but over time, talking with Lexi, he never really gave more. We, we always pushed him to try to give us as much information as he could. Of course, he only ever just gave us enough information to satisfy us for the moment, and then we'd have to beg him for more, and it was a, a very casual exchange. It was something that I'd never seen done in a game before, and I've played a lot of free-to-play games, and I've also been in communities for the AAA titles and things of those natures, and never have I met a community manager who was so open to the community, the actual community. Not just say in the forums only. But he was with the, the, all of the Facebook groups, if I'm not mistaken. He was in every single one of them. And that's something that I can say was unique to Lexi. I'd never seen that done before, and it surprised me that this guy was the community manager. If you really needed a question answered, he was the guy to go to. You could literally get just about any answer you wanted from him, whether it was a good answer or a smart-ass answer. And I think we're going to miss Lexi. He was... One of the best teams I've ever met, and I don't think we'll have a replacement anywhere near as good as him. I wish Lexi the best of luck, and this is on my channel specifically because I don't feel that bashing kick size should be on BV. Uh, in all honesty, those guys are good, and they're respectful, but I, I, my opinion of kick size has been considerably lower. I thought they had potential, and I thought they had a good chance of bringing a comeback for the community, but losing Lexi... He was your trump card. He was the fakes of Kexai to most of us. And losing Lexi is going to hurt Kexai more than they know. Whoever's replacing him, so help me. I feel sorry for you. You have my undying pity. To deal with a community like we are, we're very unfair. We're unwilling. We're, to put it bluntly, we're very stubborn. We're, we, we have what we want. We know what we like. And for the most part, we are just going to say it how it is. We tell you how we see it, and we're blunt. Very blunt. And if we think you're stupid, we're going to tell you you're stupid. You might not like that, and whoever's replacing Lexi, they might not like that. But if you shoo away or shun away the community, well, it's all alone for Kekshai and Vega. We'll just switch to something else. In fact, most of us already have, but we're not going to let you know that. <laughs> Alright, Rebels. Uh, like I said, Lexi was a great CM. I'm going to miss him, of course, and I don't know who's replacing him, but... I certainly feel sorry for them. Alright, Rebels, let me know down in the comments. Are you going to miss Lexi? Did you hate him? Did you love him? <laughs> Maybe you'll see this video and you can read some of the comments or reply back. I don't know. Alright, I'm going to wrap this up right about here. So long, Lexi. See you on the flip side. Laters. What's up, gamers? If you liked what you saw, I've got a couple more videos in the annotations. One from myself, Bernie DM. Another from a buddy, Rose Lily97. Check them out. And also, hit that like, subscribe, and everything. Also, follow us on Facebook, Tumblr, Twitter, Google+. All the places we should, and some we shouldn't. Laters.